गुड इवनिंग एवरी वन सो माई टॉपिक इज प्रिडिक्टिव मॉडल फॉर द डिजीज डायग्नोस सो वट वी आर डिस्कसिंग इट्स अ प्रॉब्लम समरी देन ऑब्जेक्टिव देन डाटा एक्सप्लोरेशन डेटा क्लीनिंग मॉडल ट्रेनिंग आई एम यूजिंग रैंडम फॉरेस्ट एंड डिसीजन ट्री देन फीचर इंपॉर्टेंट फैक्टर एट कंक्लूजन सो प्रॉब्लम समरी इज अल्थ केयर प्रोफेशन ऑफन रिलाई ऑन द वेरियस डायग्नोस्टिक टेस्ट एंड बायोमेट्रिक टू असिस्ट एंड इंडिविजुअल हेल्थ स्टेटस एंड डायग्नोस डिजीज In this scenario, we have to access our data sets containing multiple healthcare-related attributes such as cholesterol level, blood cells, hormone hormone level, and other psychological measures. So, objective of this project is to build a model, accurate accurately classifying individual into disease or non-disease category based on their health attributes. By leveraging machine learning algorithm, we have to aim a create uh, create a relatable tool that all healthcare provides can use to assess in disease diagnosis. so now we have to check the uh, data exploration uh, what kind of a variables we are available so it's a cholesterol hemoglobin platelets white blood cells red blood cells and so on so now we have to do the data cleaning in data cleaning we have to check that what are the numericals column what are the categorical column then we have to fill that numerical column and categorical column likewise so we have to eliminate the missing value for that as you can see there is no missing value now in in uh, now glucose is showing zero cholesterol is showing zero hemoglobin is also showing zero so now we have to split the data into train and test fields so as you can see x train shape is 235 24 and x uh, x train shape is 486 out of 24 now we have to use the model now we have to put the model over here so first model is random forest After putting this random forest, now we have to check the accuracy, precision, recall, and F1 score. So accuracy of this model is 0.41, uh, precision 0.50, recall is 0.46, and F1 score is 0.47. As we see the model uh, decision tree, so after putting the decision tree, now we have to check the accuracy, precision, recall, and F1 for the same. So accuracy for this is 0.37, precision is 0.49, recall is 0.37, and F1 is 0.39. so as you see the feature importance over here we see a mean capsule hemoglobin is the more white blood cell after that and least important insulin hemoglobin bmi and so on so in a conclusion i can say that machine learning model for the predictive modeling for the disease diagnosis can be developed using various algorithm random forest and decision tree so the random forest are the most effective model for the predicting the target variable based on the evaluating matrix provided however it is important to note that other factors such as model interpreter and computer with concept may also be important considering choosing the best model for the specific task thank you so much that's all from my side